All right. Hello. <clears throat> hey. John and I fresh off some trips. Oh, yeah. Two trips. Just, just out here having fun. Living, living. you know, the first the first week of summer. Uh, is that the is that officially believe, the first ju- week I think, of summer? Uh, was it? What, not, what? Yeah, June twentieth. It's the the mm. first week of summer. All yeah. right, you kicking know, off hot girl summer. Off hot girl summer, white boy summer. Yeah. Nice, yeah. White boy summer, yeah. Well, I'm yeah. back from South Dakota. I visited Joey. Mm-hmm. Nearly died a few times, probably just from <laughs> just from internal issues. <laughs> you know when your 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 back hurts so much. Probably just from internal things, but you keep cracking it. Like it's not. It's just a. <laughs> it's a bonish. I gotta just crack my back. Just and you're keep like, that fluid moving. Can't crack yeah. the kidneys. You know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. You can't, can't go to the chiropractor. And be like, just work out my liver. <laughs> can you drain my liver? Yeah, can you a fucking bit? yeah? Just, just do something. Give me a dialysis bag <laughs> at the chiropractor. You go to dialysis because you're hungover. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I, I don't want to say too much about the trip because Joey's going to be back and we can do a big full yeah. recap yeah, yeah, yeah. and I'm sure he remembers a lot. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, John, you were in, uh, where are you in Seattle? I, uh, I, I, met a, I met a girl. You were hanging out with Gabby Petito. Yeah. She lives in a, she lives in a, in a, in a truck and she's like, uh, real, uh, real like, um, Real like dances with wolves, like every you know when you know, when Costner's like in the middle of nowhere and he's just like doing all his stuff. Yeah. Um, Speaking of Costner, I went to Deadwood, the town. That, like, oh, and we walked. The first thing I, we asked people was like, "You guys, what do you think of Costner?" And they all go, I, "If I never saw that guy again, it'd be the greatest thing." In the <laughs> <laughs> every worker in South Dakota fucking hates Kevin Costner. Jesus, they hate him. Apparently, he's a huge dick. Yeah, he, and he he tried to open up like a fine dining restaurant in oh, Deadwood, an and all these like Appalachian like Ozark people were like. It this shit out of our town. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is Francois? Yeah, like sashimi. <laughs> like, why don't you suck my pussy, faggot? <laughs> Tartar, uh, lick my butt pussy, <laughs> <laughs> fucking asshole. It really was like like everybody I asked. We were like, yeah. we were, they're like, is, is Cosner been here? And they were like, fuck that guy. <laughs> Jesus fuck Kevin Christ, Cosner. Dude. Yeah, I used to fill up gas next to me. At, uh, if you went to the Chevron where I grew up, he used to like live in the neighborhood. Yeah, and he would like fill up his. You'd, if you went to the Chevron on like a Friday, like a Saturday morning, like four in the morning, you'd see Costner there with all of his ATVs, and he'd be like filling them up. <laughs> he's just a fake cowboy. The guy yeah, thinks yeah. he's yeah. like Wyatt Earp. Yeah, the guy. It's like I feel like these people are like so detached from reality. They just detach themselves. Whoever had they had the most fun playing. Mm-hmm. You're Kevin Costner. I, I love when actors. Uh, think they like are just becoming the role that they're known for so yeah, they, yeah. they act like that's who they actually yeah. are yeah, it's yeah. always hilarious well it's like the, 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 they heard that Louis story where Louis had to like pitch like like award show like an award show speech to like Martin Sheen and Martin Sheen picked up the phone he was working on a Civil War movie and he wouldn't break character he's like <laughs> he's like who is this <laughs> Mr. Louis C.K. <laughs> you wanna lick a whiskey Mr. C.K. <laughs> yeah those guys are retarded but um so uh yeah, no, she's, uh, so I went out there, and uh, she's got, like, a, a sick rig. It's, like, got, like, a fridge in it. It's, like, a Chevy. Like she, a like, Chevy. is one of those people that, can, did she do this during, like, COVID? Like, where everyone um, converted their, like, yeah. vans into, like, yeah. a home and shit? So, like, she, she it's just, like, this is probably, like, an eight-foot bed, and then, like, you just got, like, a fridge and, like, a pretty, like, a secondary battery and shit to, like, run everything off of, and, like, there's, like, switches and shit. It's, like, the Millennium Falcon in there. It's fucking insane. And, uh, but, yeah, I go out there, and uh, I proceed to have, like, the best week of my life but like i i mean since in a while sure yeah like you're, it was you're, abu- you're abusing the best week of your I life was the best week statement. of my but you well, say you know, it a best lot. week of my life since probably our big hit little road trip sure you know sure. what i mean and then i don't remember a week that good previous to that you know what i mean i hear you but uh yeah i was uh so we're like the, the crazy thing is is like you have to like pick like the, the whole we did one night where we like stayed overnight in seattle which was like kind of freaky, right? How like, do you? Where do you park in Seattle? Where you dude, can't, we you... parked in like a fucking Ace Hardware parking lot. Oh yeah, and like you guys slept in the Chaz. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we were like in the Chaz that like that like fucking guerrilla warfare guys there <laughs> with the two machine guns. <laughs> no, no, oh dude, she took me down Aurora Boulevard with all the hookers. It was like Grand Theft Auto. It was fucking insane. It's like the red light district, dude. Or whatever, there's or what? like 300 hookers out. Oh wow. shit! There's so many hookers walking around. It's one of the craziest things I ever Metal seen. Metal police? Life. It or no. Like? Huh. The cops are just don't give a shit. Huh. It's I, I I've never been to a big major city where I was just like you know when you go to a new city you get that serotonin rush mm-hmm. and you're like oh it's in Chicago yeah it's it's the like best I went to feeling, Seattle man. and I was just like eh 
Like, it's just Seattle. Like, yeah, yeah. It was pretty. It was green. But it was like, there's something really dirty. Like, in L.A., you got to have strip clubs, like, in industrial parks, like, in commercial areas. Like, there, they're just in the middle of, like, residential zones and shit. And it was just like, I don't know about this. Yeah. But, um... Yeah, we, we the first night we go out there, we're, like, in an Ace Harbor parking lot, and we didn't realize we were in front of a preschool, and, like... You're not allowed to... You guys fuck, probably, in the van. Yeah, that's yeah. like, yeah, it could be deemed it illegal, was, right? Yeah, yeah. Who, and the van totally looked... It looked like the truck... It looked like a pedophile was just in yeah, there. Yeah. And, like, we're, we were, like, going to sleep, and, like, there's somebody, like, outside with, like, a flashlight's, like, going through it, and, like... You know, it was, like... It was real, like, fucking, like... How often did that happen? Do people come and wake you guys up? Uh, only the first night, but I think it was because we were in front of like a school. Yeah. But like, we literally were having sex that next morning and like, there's a knock on the back door and like, I had to like deal with like two Seattle police officers and like, oh shit, it was crazy. What do they say? What's the problem? They were, I, if she wasn't there, I would have gone to jail. Like I'm thoroughly convinced. Like, really? yes. Like if she For wasn't what, there to prove sleeping? I was like straight, like it was oh. in front of a preschool Oh God. and it was like, it was, it was fucking wild. Oh, um, man. But he uh, looked like he looked like Kevin Spacey's assistant, <laughs> dude. I went, I hopped out of the truck and was like, "Yeah, we're just waiting for Waste Hardware to open up. Like, you know, just we're gonna go like in the woods." Ace like, Hardware, to open <laughs> it was really, it was real. Like, <laughs> we're buying some lie and yeah, some, exactly. Some, <laughs> but so, um, I, I totally know some people in the preschool were like some fucking pedophiles parked out front. Like, you got to come out here. Um, but yeah, it was it was fucking sick. We mm-hmm. uh, we went to the we spent like a bunch of time in the Olympic National Forest and like. Went down and like we stayed this place called Lower Queets Valley. It was like twenty five miles away from anywhere. Mm. Yeah, it was just amazing. Nice, nice. Not, so nothing insane happened besides the cops. Uh, cops. I saw a bunch of UFOs one night. Like it was crazy. I don't know what. I know you guys are looking at me it's like a. Uh, you know what I mean? It's like, like a UFO. So, yeah. No. Okay. So like it was like this fucking empty beach, mm-hmm. and like we were. You can see the Milky Way. It was like so clear, and she was like, "Let's go like look for UFOs," and I was like, "Bullshit! Like no fucking way." Go out to the beach and like we're like laying down and like looking in the distance and like you can see satellites. It's that clear, like you know those little pinpricks and mm-hmm. they're like flying and you could see like in front of us is the ocean and and beyond that was Canada. You could see like the mountains of Canada. <clears throat> and we're sitting there, and like we start seeing this like fading white light that keeps blinking and going in and out and then like moving to the left and then coming in again and then blinking and then moving back. And then, like, we saw, like, two other lights that were moving in, like, a weird, like, X pattern, like, way off in the distance. And they weren't airplanes. Like, you could see the airplane traces. It was just fucking weird, man. It was like satellites. No, satellites, you can tell, like, a sat. It's like a pinprink. And it just moves, it moves across the horizon. Like, wow. satellites don't diverge. They don't, they're in orbit. Yeah, maybe. Um... You talk about the, yeah. you're like oh I'm looking at the Milky Way you just it's just your cum on the roof of the van. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was fun. It was fucking. It was fucking awesome. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it's, it's always cool. fun to go do something you don't know how it's, how it's going to go, and then it goes. Yeah, on. I was like really nervous, but then it just turned out to be like amazing. Yeah, nice. yeah. I told everyone it's South Dakota. Like I love Trump. Like I just pandered the whole time. Yeah, <laughs> like anytime, anytime I wasn't sure if a guy liked me or not, I was like, anyway, we just got to get these fucking libs out of this country. And, you know, Trump, <laughs> you know, we got to get Trump back and all that. And there's immediately just love you. Oh no, yeah. yeah, it's great. They yeah, the Republicans. <clears throat> Hey, you just uh, just converse about like how bad it is that Jordan Peterson got kicked off of Twitter with everybody. Yeah, it's I like, don't oh, even it's think terrible. They probably they're so they, oh, yeah, they, they probably they, think Jordan Peterson's like gay. They're like he wears suits. And <laughs> 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 speaking of Jordan Peterson, John, have you seen this? Uh, he uh, he's just the guy has just finished. It's so sad. He just this he is Peterson? was yeah. yeah he was just so willfully misrepresented by so many people for so long. Yeah, he's like gaslit, and then dog. had. And the only people that supported him were like, you know, your Ben Shapiro's and yeah, that type yeah, of yeah. shit. Where it's like he's just now he's off the zoinkies. He like sucks ass now. He's just like yeah. an idiot at this point. He, and so he like tweeted some weird shit about Elliot Page. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, um, and then <clears throat> Twitter suspended him. And then he put out this like like very angry like video. Yeah, on Daily. <laughs> she doesn't have tits anymore. Yeah, on the Daily <laughs> Wire. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's like, more, I like small tits. <laughs> Juno was great when you had titties. As long as they're not fatties. Juno, <laughs> who cares? Juno was a quirk fest. <laughs> I love Juno. Juno's so pure. It's a goddamn hamburger phone. It's fucking hilarious. And now she's a fucking trans. Why does he care? I dude, because like, it, it's, it's his it's just, his fucking grift at this yeah, point. It's yeah. like sad. Let's watch some of it. He's uh, he's fucking. He's it's a it's a real downfall. <clears throat> he's in like trans psychosis. Yeah, <laughs> like he, he 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 go at some uh-huh. point. He's like, 
on a loop. He's just like, <laughs> is it he, her, or he, them? <laughs> and is it Ellen or Elliot? And no. when? And precisely. Yeah, he's like he's like a George Carlin during that period when he was like George Carlin was getting made fun of because right. where he was like breaking words down too yes, much. Yeah, yeah, Jordan yeah. Peterson's doing that with trans people. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on, play the fucking video, you cocksuckers. Here we go. All right. Play! <laughs> this looks like that. Uh, Fuck. Jesus Christ. Listen. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, he looks go. like something out of Starship Troopers. Like one of those propaganda videos. Like he got a, a few studio. days ago, I penned an irritated tweet <laughs> in response to one of the latest happenings on the increasingly heated culture oh, war. He's dressed like he works for Al Capone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the decision of an actress. Me an and Scarface. <laughs> Elliot Page. I told Twitter, don't you ever fuck me. This I was talking to Meyer Lansky the other day and <laughs> it came to my attention he's a goddamn Jew. <laughs> <laughs> the only In Jew I fuck with is Shappy. <laughs> it is now apparently mandatory and I'm probably doing it wrong nonetheless as you're doing it wrong is the whole point of what is being made mandatory, but also they got a studio for this. Point. Yeah, it fucking blows I've my mind. I've essentially been banned from Twitter as a consequence. He's not banned. They suspended banned, you for like an hour. Although technically, <laughs> I have technically. been suspended, but the suspension will not be lifted unless I delete the hateful tweet in question. And I would rather die than do that. Really? <laughs> <laughs> not come to that. Although who the hell knows? Come for in me. These increasingly <laughs> strange days. Fuck with me, Twitter. It'll get <laughs> biblical. I will die for my the cause. Twitter. Hello, everyone. Hello. George organization. Gandhi, with MLK, and JP. Sensorial actions. I should at least know exactly what I did wrong <laughs> if I am required to acknowledge that <laughs> my tweet violated the Twitter rule. <laughs> what? What Talking so seriously about a tweet, you're just exactly. automatically going to look uh, like an idiot. Jordan or Peterson, looks he, so look, he looks what? You know he those pictures of St. Valentine's Day Massacre with all the guys against the wall <laughs> yeah, yeah, like yeah. the blood? He looks like one of those fucking... <laughs> yeah. like, he looks like he like wears spurs like, yeah. around the house. <laughs> he looks like he goes to the Foot Locker. He's like, "Where are your spurs? <laughs> I need chaps. I need to." I'm he's, right. he's the he's the cowboy that like is the dandy. He's like the cowboy that shows up and plays yeah. poker real good. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You can't get on, fatty. You'll tip the stagecoach. <laughs> <laughs> because such things matter when the accusations start flying. So what did I say that might what, constitute... What? He says everything so angry and pointed I now. know. Like, he used to just, like, say stuff, and now he's like... Like, and... and. Even him saying just and, you're like, God, he's so pissed at I the know. word and. Yeah, Precis trying to be like Precisely! <laughs> <laughs> he needs to get back on the bars. Well, maybe yeah, I liked him more. It's like it's like Eminem, like early with. Eminem. It's like he got sober, Remember and he just he's putting out recovery now. Was a mm -hmm. sin? <laughs> Although that's Jordan Peterson. Yeah, this, this is revival. <laughs> old rules applicable even a decade ago. Oh, you're going to ban me from Twitter? Well, sin. that's an awfully hot coffee pot. <laughs> perhaps the cardinal sin for thousands of years previously. It still might be regarded as unacceptable to the woke authoritarian moralists who now insist, for example, that we celebrate Pride Month, not hour or day or week, but month. Yeah, there's, yeah, Jordan, there's tons what? of months. Pride like, month. there's like, you know. Instead of LGBT plus month or whatever else alphabet acronym, which is currently insisted upon as the only acceptable enlightened terminology. Hasn't there always been a Pride Month? Or no, but there's for like, like a while, there's been a Pride Month, there's I like, thought, right? He, he's saying it's uh, de it was demonized before, and the reason for Pride was because it was considered a sin being gay. I mean, it, it still is. Right. Uh, let's right. make that clear. Yeah. It yeah. isn't. But, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, so there, oh, I see what he's doing. Oh, yeah. Like he's like, he's like, up, everyone, yeah. he's like, everyone accepts you now. So what's why the, do you even yeah, need, what, what's the point of the month? It's, it's, it's what everyone's Jordan, saying. Jordan it's just Peterson. now unlikable because he much. said it. I, I don't yeah. think the pride month is about like, you know, like the Cain and Abel, like one of them had a sheep, like the biblical pride. Yeah, like yeah. You can, there's many definitions uh, of words. Like, I mean, yeah, it's pride month fucking. 
Yeah, it's well, that's what corny. we're talking about. Yeah, Precisely. It's fucking, like, These Precisely, definitions. John. Isn't there, like, These fucking, definitions. isn't there like Save the World Month or some shit where everybody goes green? Like, isn't there a bunch of different months? Mm. Like, you know. yeah, I thought there's a yeah, there's a month for everything. There's a month yeah. for fucking everything. Yeah. Except white people. Yeah. Where's our Listen, month? Oh, is it whole, every we month? We got the whole fucking the whole year. year huh? <laughs> well, I'd like them to <laughs> specify one. <laughs> we got the whole goddamn year. I'd like them to specify <laughs> one. Make it clear for one. Keep in mind, this is a white year. <laughs> but you get your little black month. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's wild. It's it's almost like it's almost they're two sides of the same coin. Like these kind of like uh, he used to just kick so much ass. This guy. I'm sure he can. I'm sure if he got if you got him in front of a mic and like and like fi- like yeah. sat, sat yeah. in front of some fucking like yeah just get him in front of a mic. You can you know. still battle. Yeah. They're yeah, like they're like, still, they're yo, like JP. Roll. Like you pulled like you Sorry. pulled. You, <laughs> They're like, you pulled a lickety split in the first round. <laughs> JP's like, I don't give a fuck who it is. <laughs> fuck the free world. <laughs> three, one, three. Uh. <laughs> he went to Cranbrook. It's a cultural Marxist hub. <laughs> so, so my boy Ben did fuck his sister. I'm still standing here screaming, fuck Ellie Page. Oh, oh, fuck. All right, let's keep I'll going. I'll dead name guy. you, bitch. I, don't regard I will pride. dead name I will you. Dead name you. <laughs> I will put you in a body bag. You'll be so dead named. <laughs> I will body bag you. <laughs> Classically regarded as a sin. I don't see that sexual orientation or sexual desire of any sort is something to celebrate or to take pride in. And so what I said. I mean, that's a, yeah, a that's fact. that's a point. Well, I get that. Yeah. I do think it's who weird how everyone shit? nowadays leads with uh, who they like to come around. Yeah, yeah. that's odd. Yeah, like, I don't shouldn't have to think about that. I don't yeah. care. Well, every but everyone, it's like everyone off the bat. They're like, listen, I like to come next to women, or <laughs> I like to come next to men. I don't care who I come around. It's just a very strange. It's a little forward. Earlier this year, someone in like a in like an honest conversation, like a totally casual conversation, just like asked me if I was a sub or a dom, and yeah, I was it, like, "What?" It's a very casual <laughs> I was thing. Like, now. What the fuck? That's like, all we do. That's all we do. Who gives? Like yeah. what? None You're of like, your business. Yeah. A dom. Dom. Yeah. John, all right. yeah. I, I will control you. I know we just you. met. <laughs> John, you're a really cool guy. I know we just met, but uh, who do you like to get cleaned out by? <laughs> do you in, like to, in what position do you like to get cleaned out? Do you, you know, it's it's like it's so fucking boring. Do you like lame. to do you like to have shit impacted in your ass from below or from above? <laughs> I know we met four minutes ago. But <laughs> it, this is the way. Come on, it's can cool. I piss in your face? I'm a progressive. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Remember when they used to say like like, like if you had like a yellow bandana <laughs> on your back pocket, like it meant you like piss. Uh, like you remember that uh, shit in like God. high school? Yeah, there's a million of those things yeah. for, gay, for, the, for gay people, especially in, when you were in high school in our era. Oh yeah, everyone had a thing. I was like, like if you, you wear you, white pants, you like anal yeah. sex. If you wear gray khakis, <laughs> like, if you wear gray khakis, dude, that means you love bukkakis. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, what's the thing with the earring? Which which ear? Right, yeah, the, I, right I, ear? the right the ear. Right I ear. got my right ear pierced, and like my my mom was like, my mom kept going like that's that's the gay side, Johnny, and I kept being like, <laughs> and, you know, I kept, I kept I would just be like I, I just kept like torch. Or I'd be like, yeah, you know, I just can't suck in cock now. Like, I just love sucking cock. <laughs> uh, All right. Hurt someone's feelings. Oh. Because I pointed out that pride. He's a leprechaun with a PhD. It really is. It's insane. <laughs> it's like, it's like the luck of the Irish. Yeah. There's, a, there's three again. dudes, uh, leprechauns stacked up, and yeah. his head is put yeah, on. Yeah, it's it. just three leprechauns yeah. in a, in a fucking trench suit. coat, yeah. like on top of each but, other. But in a three piece suit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Warn those who are about to fall into a pit that the path they are on leads suddenly downhill. Oh wait, this is like a three-parter. It's a, it's oh, it's a bunch of parts. Minutes. God. The whole few days ago, and these are just clips. Irritated tweet in response. Dude, Ellen slash Elliot has undoubtedly. <laughs> he loves that. <laughs> yeah, no. he loves to purposely like yeah. not just. It's she's Elliot or he's Elliot now. Sorry, Jesus. Sorry. Has she know. done any? Has oh, has he done anything to him or like what? What did anything happen that? Like, oh, started I mean, she's uh, he's been um uh. He, I think he, uh, Elliot called out some people without evidence of some stuff. Uh, I, yeah, think, are, I think he's know. a hypocrite or whatever about some yeah. bullshit, but everyone is in Hollywood. That's, I, you that's, know, that's I, leading with their identity. Here's the deal, man. Like I said, leading with who they fuck or what they uh, what they are. Imagine like being like, I want to be a man now. Yeah. And like you, you, you do all this stuff. And yeah. And you just look like a 14 year old boy. Yeah. Like that would suck. I wish he was Elliot Page and Juno. It would have been funnier. Yeah, that would have been great. <laughs> <laughs> you know? you're, 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 it's like the pregnant man emoji. Like, <laughs> uh, you know, I just, 
you know, just Precisely. They're, they're living. <laughs> they're yeah, living, there's a, they're living in hell. There's, a, there's now a, we live in utter hell. There'd be a scene in a uh, in Juno where she gets mad at the owner of a business because there's no tampons in the men's bathroom. Right. Yeah. Yeah. She's like, "What is this?" Well, now now she's now Jordan she's Peterson. Jordan Peterson. They, <laughs> in South Dakota, I couldn't tell. They're like, I. It was like they went with the whole like uh, gender neutral bathrooms, but it just said at a bar, it just said whatever. Yeah, those, those are, I love seeing those. And it I had love like a, those. it was like a man with like half a skirt on. Yeah, I love seeing those. Or it was like kind yeah. of like fuck you, but yeah, yeah little, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Have a little fun with it, you know? I like that. So called courage. And remember, the White House itself has tweeted out every indication of believing in the courage of those who transition. Enticed many a poor, I'm leaning on my Tommy gun right now. <laughs> girl, most likely, to blame her emergent, pubescent self consciousness, confusion, and discomfort on being born in the wrong body <laughs> and believing that the courageous self affirming My daughter feeds me steak with sedatives in it every night. <laughs> oh, dude, th- l- let's look at that real quick. Oh, look yeah. at this shit. He has such a weird relationship with his daughter. Look at just like the, the, the thumbnails. The yeah. problem, or the hookup culture and gender differences, and they're both looking at each other like they yeah. just fuck. <laughs> I mean, li- literally, it's like my, I, every night I have Michaela feed me poison mushrooms, and <laughs> she nurses me back to health <laughs> as, as a piano plays in the distance. <laughs> she, she puts a block between my feet, and, then, and she slams them with sledgehammers. <laughs> <laughs> He's just beating her to death with a typewriter. So you're trans. <laughs> What's my, the problem with my kink being my ankles broken? <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? Uh, we all have a thing. You <laughs> goddamn trans people. You don't think I like a sledgehammer to the balls? <laughs> <laughs> I got caught in a snowstorm and Michaela was the one who saved me. I like being tied up like a mental patient. <laughs> bludgeoned <laughs> until the point of needing medical help. Oh I boy. like being put in a medical, uh, medically induced coma, <laughs> and then I uh, and then my family asked the doctor to jack me off while I'm in the coma. Oh uh, God, yeah, he's really, it's really like weird, like turn of the century, like creepy, like I'm, I love my daughter. It really is turn uh, of the yeah, century. It's like, like me, she's so perfect. <laughs> it's, it's the most perfect weird. Aryan woman on planet Earth. <laughs> Michaela, did you go? Did you pick mushrooms today? <laughs> I hope they're the ones that make my tummy hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a cold washcloth, Michaela? Uh, their life is an A24 film. Michaela, what that pussy do? <laughs> <laughs> Michaela, what that mouth do, you goddamn... <laughs> You whore! <laughs> Riding the back of my fame with your steak show, uh, your show where you talk about steak. I started the steak industry. <laughs> that was my grift. My grift was meat. <laughs> All you did was suck my meat. I love your beef flaps. <laughs> your pussy looks like bulgogi, Michaela. <laughs> You That's got that. why I had to eat it. I like to put some kimchi on it. You got that KBBQ pussy. <laughs> <laughs> All you can eat. You got that 1999 pussy. <laughs> All you can eat, Michaela. <laughs> 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 there's, a, there's a buzzer in my office that summons Michaela <laughs> like a waitress at a Korean barbecue. But pussy comes with potato salad <laughs> and little noodles. Every time I fuck Michaela, I, they can they never bring me enough rice paper. Well. I like to wrap her up in rice paper and eat her out. Oh uh, fuck! What happened to her like Russian husband? Is that like still a thing? Oh, who knows? He probably got indicted or something for. <laughs> Yeah. Some bullshit. He got, he got killed by John Wick. Oh, speaking of which, did we talk about fucking Ghislaine Maxwell? Yeah, she got uh, less time than R. Kelly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Big win for women. I'm Wild. happy for them. They yeah. needed a win that week. Yeah, they needed yeah. a win. They needed yeah, they win. lost I mean, after Wade, Wade, needed... you know. Yeah. Yeah. You know. I got to say, a couple weeks, or what has it been, a week and a half gone by? Week and a half. Good. Yeah, I don't care anymore. Yeah, it's, that's it's how it goes. Insane. They'll, they'll figure it out. That yeah. woman facilitated like the rape of minors with like high members of our society. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. them no, we gonna... have we have no info on it. Of course, there's no info on even how the court case really went. So, yeah, you know, there's like drawings. You're like, did we get, it? Yeah, so we get a doodle. You're not even sure if it happened. Yeah, like somebody <laughs> made insane. an edge sketch yeah. of it. Yeah. Somebody's like, yeah. <laughs> like drawing dicks, and they're like, here you go. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's yeah. wild. They only allow, like. Why can't you just take a picture? Yeah. I what know. is this weird, weird fucking rule? 
Let's take a photo. Oh, well, because it's a federal case, so there's no you no cameras but allowed. You got, in a, it. you got a dude with some charcoal in there, like some art student. I mean, like, it's just also take just a picture. It's just completely insane that R. Kelly got more time than that woman. I mean, she is a yeah. horrific human she's being, a, she, like R. Yeah. Kelly, but not the same. Right? No, that is insane. Come on, R. Kelly was like Chuck Berry level. You know what I mean? Like he's like yeah. transferring like minors across state lines. Like Gislaine, just how the fuck do you say her name? Gislaine? I think it's Gillane. Jis- I was like, like Gislaine. If you, res- I don't know. If you, I like respect, if you yeah. respect her, it's Gillane. It's I mean, Gillane. I like it. Gislaine. Come back in Maxwell. <laughs> yeah, it's like. <laughs> fucking old whore. <laughs> well, the, 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 what, 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 what we're going to find cum out bucket. now. Madam Cumbucket, piece of shit, pedophile aid. I, I wonder if she starts talking in prison to like people around her. I, that would be, that's going to be interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> you know? But, uh, but pull up that take uh, of that dude on Roe v. Wade. Everyone, everyone's been talking about it. He's like blaming. He's, he's essentially saying. You sent it to me? Yeah, I sent it to you. He's a. Uh, I forget his name, but he's essentially saying that like uh, Jews. Oh, Nick Fuentes. Yeah. Play, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Fuentes thing. Yeah, Jew, Jews did this. That guy's out of his mind. Yeah. This yeah. guy's like 14 years old. And he's like this huge Republican online, or not oh, even Republican. God. He's like a, just an insane guy. But. Yeah. That Amy Coney Barrett, a, hell of a, a Catholic take. woman, could be appointed in her place. Roe versus Wade would still be the law of the land. Yeah. Think about that. Dude, think about that shit. If Ruth Bader Ginsburg, a, a Jewish woman, yeah. didn't yeah, die yeah. last year. So that Amy Coney Barrett, a Catholic yeah. woman, could be appointed to the bench. Jimmy, we would Pate. still have shoulders. Yeah. Now, like now you so tell stiff. me that this is a Judeo-Christian country. Now you tell me that this. I just saw the AF at the bottom for a second. I thought it was the, the as fuck uh, uh, ATC. I was like, all things comedy is doing this. Same <laughs> show. It's a Judeo-Christian movement. You tell me that it doesn't matter. I feel like we're living in a, a spoof. Lot of these Jewish this looks like yeah, a yeah. fake thing. Yeah. Government. Yeah. Well, this is everyone. Tell show me that it doesn't. This it's is like, what everyone looks show like. Looks Starship like. Troopers or like fucking Tropic Thunder. Like it's crazy. Everyone show is just like just put up New York in the background, and I'm gonna yell like I'm gonna be a Jew hating piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be anti-Semitic. <laughs> That's what every show is. Everyone's like, I got New York in the background. You know, city no Jews there. Yeah, and I'm gonna yell about the Jews. Yeah. That's how hardcore I am. I'm going to do it with their fucking city. Yeah, exactly. In the background, fucking Jews. Matter after a decision like fucking this. Jules. Tell me that with a straight face, that it doesn't matter that we had a court that had four <laughs> Jewish people on it, and we had subtract one Jewish woman and increase one Catholic woman. And then and subtract now another six million, and we're and doing something right again. Americans will live in states with no abortion because of that change, because we had a Jewish woman, and now we have a Catholic woman. Tell me religion doesn't matter. Tell me that this dispute between Judeo and Christian of Americans doesn't Catholic. matter. It absolutely it, it, matters. It makes all the difference. Because Clearly. Oh, really? What's ridiculous about it, Richie? I'll tell you. I kind of think he's great. It's a ridiculous. <laughs> I think he's gone. I'll tell you. It's a ridiculous take because Jewish people would not uh, just let perfectly fucking suckable baby dicks die like that. <laughs> that's very true. All right? no, that's true. Yeah, it's true. It's a, it's not. Also, Jews I mean, would not do that. That's very I mean, true. They the love they Epstein, love live baby dicks. Epstein. You know what'd you say? Uh, and they're like they're like fucking them too. Yeah, exactly. You know I and mean? it's crazy. Oh, Epstein! I forgot Epstein was a Jew. That was that was the thing. That's the craziest thing about the Epstein case is what what's wild about that is that it was it was a it was like a shadow group of Ashkenazi supremacists. Yeah, it was very weird. Yeah, and, yeah. and we us Jews need more chattel. Yeah, to uh, <laughs> I love the, that word. That's labor. such a great word, chattel. <laughs> mm. Should, is this, should we keep going with this? I don't know what he's rambling. I'm not really sure. He's rambling as if Catholics. And, and, it's and, more and, psychosis. Like everybody yeah, today, yeah. Uh, Peterson wanna, and this guy are just in psychosis. Like, the, but there's four of them. Yeah. I mean, it's just a bunch you're of, telling me. It's a bunch of unfunny Anthony Camillas. Yeah. yeah like much, at least Anthony yeah. Camilla can make his like anti-Semitism, yeah. his yeah. black hatred kind yeah. of funny. Yeah. yeah. Even yeah. though it's despicable, you know? He, he takes it a little too far. Takes a little too far. I still think he's one of the funniest people ever, but. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Easily. He's probably like the worst guy that I secretly still love. Secretly? I still, I still, not secretly, I but I, I love him to death, but I, yeah. I'm not going to go run through the streets. And he, wear, he's wear like, a he's like your dad media that shirt. just goes too crazy. Like, he just yeah. went off the deep end. Like, I, I, I miss when he was, like, cooler. He's like John Wayne. Always, yeah. I'm still going to watch Red River. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, I don't yeah. want to hear his thoughts on the natives. Love but. that motherfucker. Yeah. Uh, All right, uh, enough of this guy. Um, Should we watch a little more of the JPs? Yeah. Uh, yeah, go back to JP. I mean, they're on YouTube, there's like a 14-minute one. Uh, we got, I don't got time for I that. mean, we've already Ooh. pretty much... 
You don't want to listen to me for 14 minutes? How, How long precisely do you want to listen to me? How much time do you need? How need long until the sauce is ready, Ellen Mama? Slash Elliot or whatever the hell <laughs> he is. Oh, he keeps being is. so <laughs> upset at her, at her name. And, and, and there's so, so much vit the vitriol. So much vitriol. Vitriol in my tone. culpability for that. And finally... With regard to he's really he's got a really good uh criminal like evil position. one eye pop I must say yeah that, that he leans into sometimes so to speak regrets about that phrase it is clearly the case that the surgical operation performed by the butchers who butchered <laughs> <Elliot>. <laughs> oh, god <laughs> Oh, God. He's like... <laughs> She's a monster. Elliot Page, my favorite character in Gangs of New York. Yeah. <laughs> Killed by Bill the Butcher. <laughs> I'm going to speak you to not have him in the teacher and not have tits with this knife, Elliot. <laughs> I mean, that's the type of stuff where it's like, all right, dude, of course you're now going to get the yeah. trans community on your back. You're just being a dick. Yeah, now. I know. Like, yeah. You're saying they're being butcher. Like, if you know... She wanted yeah. to do it. Yeah. She did yeah. it. Who cares? Let's How is that different than some chick loaded up with Botox? Yeah, like, right. You know, right. like, who gives a shit? Right, exactly. Well, yeah, let him do it. Whatever. Yeah. Was legal. So, was it criminal? <laughs> I mean, it <laughs> was it also, <laughs> you know, his his better point, which, listen, I'm not going to yeah. I'm not gonna sound any better than him right now saying it, but, like, his the best point to make would be, like, this needs to stop happening because it's likely a career move. So people are almost hurting yeah. Yeah. real trans people that have to do it where it's like all these Hollywood people. I'm like, is this just so you get a big boost in your career now? Yeah. You, you know, nobody really had heard about you for a while. Now you're trans. You now got, you're on all the shows. You, you have again. a few options uh, in you can go trans. You can say you're like suicidal now and depressed and go on like the mental health. Yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The old school one is uh, rehab. rehab. Exactly. Yeah. Sobriety. That's it. still out. Demi Lovato, you know, right, uh, right, is a California sober. Yeah, or not, all, all the dumbest people on earth are all suffering from intense mental illness. Yes. they're all yeah. so smart. They just they've they've yeah. fought their they're way so into a corner too. in their yeah. mind. Yeah. <laughs> Bunch of idiots. Just oh, they just think too much. Demi Lovato just she can't even she can't break out of this <laughs> mental yeah. prison she's yeah. created just for herself. Heroin. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, hey, Demi, spell cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, play the uh, play MGK. That, that flows perfectly. Oh, yeah. I actually just watched oh MGK's documentary, I, I, and I saw this scene in Life it. in Pink. Where, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Where he, he exploits his uh, mixed daughter for 90 minutes. Yeah, it's like if Kurt Cobain was retarded and talentless. <laughs> he talks about, like, uh, you know, almost killing himself. Uh something Yo. I'm proud of. It wasn't my choice to have that in a documentary, I think. Oh, that no, what, no, keep it. Why is he dressed? No, no, no. Why is he got oh, Betty on, Rubble? Hold on, no, he was talking on. about. Oh, you you played it. Yeah, I, I, played I had it for it. a second. Right? Oh, okay. right. Started from the beginning. Started from the beginning. How have you? Rising, like. Keep this going. is this is where the clip you sent me started. Oh, okay. That was kind of where I started realizing like something's not. Right. Yeah, you're yeah. retarded. Yeah, you, you were deprived. You're a re you were fucking retarded. Here's the thing. Here's the thing, MGK. You were weeks. deprived of oxygen at birth. And yeah. The doctors did. They didn't tell your family about yeah. that. How, but the umbilical this, cord was stuck around your neck, and now you're this. <laughs> you're very famous, and you make a lot of money, and you you fuck Meg and Fox, but you're you're talentless, and your thoughts don't matter. Yo, you just saying they just not ready for me, dude. I'm not kidding. That's this documentary haters... that I was watching, it is the, his music. It's because it's he all he like switched to like Blink 182 style music, uh, so he makes like pop rock now. Yeah, he it's the worst music I've like ever heard. Like, is it even like at the fair like that stuff, or is it like, that is way better? No, really? it's, it's like trying to be like that. But kind then of, emo, but there's like a more emo sound. To I it. went in my Louder car the other day. Yeah. I was driving and I went through all his songs. I was like, was he even ever like okay at rap? Like, I mean, yeah. he could rap fast. Yeah. But like, did he ever make a song that is listenable? I remember, all I remember is he Wild Boy. Is, he is talentless musically. He has yeah. zero musical talent. He's like, cool. it's, it's his insane. Songs are horrible. Songs are horrible. Yeah. They're fucking horrible. Mm -hmm. Healed from that experience that you went through. I'm, I'm almost, uh, look at his fucking I Betty Rubble. I just want to hear him say what, when he pulls the trigger. I think that some of those things, like. Uh, in, in, in speaking on the truth Dude, he's the last retarded. Years. He's like, so I'm just trying to like find my words. Like my mind is just always on. <laughs> That's always their excuse. They're always, I'm just like, think so much. So, like, it's like, yeah. I can't even get the words out. Yo, like I'm here, but my mind is in the studio. Yeah. That it's all, it's also them. on a lot of ketamine, wanna, but like, it's also in the studio. Anything, so I gave everyone full permission to put things in there. Certain things didn't make it in there, which I'm glad they didn't. But uh, I mean, it's been an interesting two years of um, the fame 
taking on a different when does he talk life about than I could have Shocking. imagined it, it doing, and then maybe it's maybe me sabotage I've ever witnessed. Well, hopefully you didn't tattoo Here. fake to pink on your body. What? Hey, and just. Yeah, you so even, it's coming. Again. Did I put the shotgun in my mouth? <laughs> oh my God! Please kill yourself. I'm yelling on the phone. He's in a big argument with Megan Fox <laughs> at the moment. Oh, that sounds cool. Yeah, Megan Fox probably getting railed by like yeah. eight men. <laughs> the barrels in my mouth, and I go to cock the shotgun, and the bullet, <clears throat> as it comes back up, the shell just gets jammed. <laughs> This is such a lie. It's Total like, lie. This didn't no, happen. That, did not that do definitely this. could happen. He's just retarded and doesn't have a load this of did, shotgun. This did not happen. <laughs> if we cut to the real scene right now, if the shotgun is a super soaker. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I start realizing like something's not something's right. I gotta, I gotta <laughs> screw <laughs> loose, dog. No, like, Yo, like I gotta uh, screw loose, dog. How, how uh, sick would it be if he blew his head off with a shotgun? That uh, would yeah, be I so know. fucking yeah. cool. Yeah, it, I would love that. It'd be very funny. And then Megan. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be so happy. I like would, if I woke yeah. up and got that news in the morning, I'd, I'd be just like, be like yeah. be a wow. little extra pep in my step. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'd be like, fuck yeah, dude. Wouldn't it be much of a mess either. Oh no, yeah. yeah. It's just because <laughs> there's nothing upstairs. There's nothing up there. Just, nothing up there. Yeah, no. It's like a water balloon. <laughs> <laughs> there's just a bunch of water <laughs> everywhere. Water. The cops are like, oh my god, this is the truest form of a waterhead I've ever seen. <laughs> This hardwood's gonna get logged. Get him. We need to get the body. The hardwood's here. getting moldy. <laughs> Machine gun Kelly's brains off of it. Oh god. Um, uh, we are very mean. Sorry, Machine Gun no, Kelly, but I, you suck and you're a cancer in our society. And I'm sick of hearing your awful music. And I'm sick of you being. I've public, never heard a public it. figure. I'm just. He, you I've have. You have. You ever gone to like Walmart? I've heard. <laughs> <laughs> That's where it is. They play it at Walmart. Sure, I'm sure. Yeah, they I, do. I remember when like wa that that first song you came out with. That's that's all I remember hearing. Yeah, well, and then all wild it boy. Is, I'm a wild boy. Like that yeah, shit. And yeah. then and then all of a sudden it's just like he's just everywhere. He's just cool looking. He can rap. Like he's a decent rapper, but yeah, has, I'm sure can't, he's a better it, rapper. Has, than most is people. tone deaf? Is yeah. can't? Has no? His he's beats no are flow. awful. Like it's just he's yeah. just an annoying person. He's too. also like just I, super annoying. I watched yeah. some of the documentary, and he like comes out of the studio. And it just finished like the album, and he's like, he immediately, you know, he gets a tattoo across his neck, mm -hmm. and then he gets in his Ferrari or something, lights a blunt immediately. And it's just like we gotta like car test this album. I'm driving fast, listening to the whole album, dog, and then gets pulled over, and the whole it's like everything's just staged. It's all staged. I, I feel like it's all staged. It's all staged. Yep. Yeah. Yep. No, he's he's uh, he's a fraud. I mean, it's he's just <sighs> he's you know he thinks he's like a rock star now. Yeah. There are no the last rock stars Jack White. They're all drinking. Yeah. They're, him, they're yeah. him and Megan Fox are like drinking each other's blood. <laughs> like hopefully, hopefully one of you has AIDS. Yeah. Yeah. I know. God, yeah. I hope he kills himself. That'd if he, so if he killed, cool. if he killed himself, <laughs> <laughs> that'd be the coolest be. shit. And then dude. you get to hear uh, Megan Fox like still try to slip in being intellectual when yeah. she's being like interviewed about it. Where yeah, she'd yeah. Be like it was horrible. His brains got all over my. First edition of Infinite Jest, which I've yeah. read three times, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Aren't they like saying stuff like that? Like they're acting like like, like they she, read Infinite Jest. Yeah, she that. always tries to you know uh, shoehorn in the fact like, don't forget, I read. I read. I'm right. really smart. I'm Megan Fox. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She I'm has reading. like paragraphs all over like yeah. her body and shit. Yeah, You're probably like, like what a, Oscar Wilde quotes. Yeah, or something. yeah. It's more like it's probably Coach Carter. <laughs> <laughs> uh, You're like this quote. This is. There's a big paragraph on my rib cage. That's John Q. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, there was something else in the documentary that I saw that was really, really hilarious where he's, oh, there's like a whole portion of it where they can't help but show it. Like they talk about how hated he is. Yeah. Oh, so like awesome. half the concerts he does, like he's getting booed off stage and people are throwing <laughs> shit at him. And like half of the documentary is about his plight through people knowing his music sucks yeah. and hating him. Yeah. When he shows up randomly at an event. Oh, so it's not even like concert. It's not even like his concert. Like he'll yeah. be on stage yeah. too. Like, oh, it's like before somebody they want to see, and they're like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, I, yeah. I did. Fucking machine gun, machine Kelly. gun Ugh. Kelly. And he's like trying to do his like rock bullshit. Yeah, <laughs> acting like he's like fucking Johnny Rotten <laughs> with his pink hair and yeah. oh god, he's such a fucking. He's what a is phony? His his it's uh, his, the album's called Tickets to My Down. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, brother. Yeah. To my downfall. And he got, it's literally yeah. only big because it's all used on TikTok. Yeah. 
What? If you go on TikTok, yeah. all the fucking brain dead like thirteen year old incest babies on there are like yeah. just blasting Machine Gun Kelly. <laughs> if you go on yeah. TikTok, there's like a whole underworld of just like the dumbest people that you could ever imagine. I don't even care if yeah. they're kids. Like just fucking put them down, okay? So like I'm like that Roe v. Wade being it's it does yeah. suck because we should abort like almost every child <laughs> in this country because they're all just gonna wind up on TikTok and then just go shoot up a school or something. And so there isn't a whole underworld on TikTok of just like it's just like dancing fifteen year olds like showing their camel toe and then just <laughs> a bunch of like just like three-eyed babies in cages like in, in Appalachia like in the basement and they're all, like dr just like living off of like monster energy drinks that, and just blast the machine gun Kelly in the song <laughs> it's fucking what a world we live in the imagery Devin I, uh, I, you know, I can, I have, a, I, can, I have good, good imagery. <laughs> good imagery. They call me, uh, who, who's good with imagery? Who, Name who? A, an author. I don't know. I don't know. All right. Whatever. doesn't matter. Okay. What are we, gay? Who wrote Captain Underpants? I've Captain always Underpants. modeled myself after the <laughs> <laughs> You're just like, yeah. Yes. Okay, you remind me of R.L. Stein with your imagery. Um, well, what's, what's next? Uh, oh, wait, no, there was one other thing I wanted to say about it. There, do you remember the one, uh, part where they play like a phone message of uh him and pete davidson or they're talking he's like yo i'm gonna send you a copy of the album right now to bring to space he's like and then he's just like dude i'm gonna blast that in space <laughs> dude that's gonna be crazy him and jeff bezos listening to mgk in space together oh god <laughs> dude it was fucking crazy we put on my fucking boy machine gun kelly and rocked out with bezos dude if that's like it was fucking sick then bezos fucking let out a Fucking huge rip, bro. Like a huge fart. Dude, Bezos. <laughs> Bezos lets him rip, bro. <laughs> yeah, dehydrated food really makes you fucking fart, bro. Like dude. when you're up there and you're having astronaut ice cream, it's fucking <laughs> crazy. Dude, dude, it's crazy because like astronaut ice cream, like I'm like, what? It's not even melting. Like, what is this? It's dairy. I'm but like, it's what's like going dry. on? It's like it tastes like ice cream, but it's like hard. It's like, what, it's like, what, where, what's even going on? Like, what is this? Like, what, what the? Who, I mean, dude, why am I even here? But it's like, dude, I'm like, but I'm like Pete Davidson. I don't, like, don't even deserve to be here. By the way, I figured out that's every single thing i've seen pete davidson be on he just leads with like i mean i don't even know why i'm here yeah every, but, every but yeah. let's just make him the most famous person alive <laughs> but i don't even know what like what do i do he's like his stand-up he's like basically just like i don't even know what i am <laughs> do i even can, am i funny no i mean i don't know and everyone's like Woo! yeah <laughs> <laughs> keep fucking the hottest woman alive yes! Woo! be the be the coolest guy for no reason we love you <sighs> What were you going to say? I'm sorry. Uh, yeah. All right. We'll move Whatever. On. Let's move yeah. on. Um, what do we got here? The lady that uh, invented like friends, like is on a big, like white guilt apology to her. Sick. Cause yeah. she, she's like, I'm sorry. There wasn't any black people in friends. <laughs> yeah. You know? There weren't, there wasn't like one black dude. No, I don't think so. Well, I mean, that's why it's such a popular show. Not not on the not <laughs> in the main cast. I mean, the main cast. Uh, yeah, it was like Succession. How many the black 90s? people would those? Yeah, people? it was like basically. It was like <laughs> that's why it's so damn succession. good. Yeah, it makes sense. How many like they? Maybe there like was like upper middle class. I bet like, somebody dated like a black girl in the show. Yeah, or something. but not on the main cast. There was <laughs> yeah. never a black person. Yeah, no, I don't. In the Friends, it was the nineties. There, they're like every show was like that. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, who gives a shit? Let's see what this. She's also. Uh, she looks like Danny DeVito. <laughs> <laughs> Trans like Danny DeVito. Yeah, she looks like fucking Danny she DeVito. Does. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. She looks like. Uh, <laughs> it took me. Yeah, she looks a like long Frank. Time to be <laughs> she, she looks like she's about to eat some rum ham. <laughs> how I internalized systemic racism. Oh, Nobody God. gives a fuck. She just has a picture of Nobody. a vague black woman, yeah, like in the uh, background. Isn't that, who is that? Who is yeah, that? I don't know. Is that Nancy know. Pelosi? She probably ran in like so, her like you <laughs> know county. Really John says, is that Nancy, Nancy Pelosi? Pelosi? I don't know, dude. What joke were you going for there? No, exactly. it looks like Nancy Pelosi. There's no joke. It oh, just from looks like afar Nancy for John, it does look oh, like. oh, she looks white kind of from yeah, her I'm angle. Distant. I'm distant. To become an ally, anti-racist. Uh, this, what's this guy doing dude, here? Shut and this the seemed fuck to me up. to be a way that I could participate. Do you know how much money she has? And she has to fake give a shit about I know. this? Are you kidding me? I don't, why is dude, it? if I had the money these people have and somebody told me that my show that was like the most popular show, yeah. one of the most popular shows ever was like racist in hindsight, I would literally buy Mars yeah. and just be the only one living there. Yeah, and then I just watch America perish, and I'd be like, "Hey, you guys shouldn't have shit on Friends." <laughs> <laughs> Why did this need to be made? Her doing this? Yeah. What is the she, purpose? She's donating. Get this. She's donating like four million dollars 
to Brandeis University, which is What's a historically that? Jewish oh. college. Ah. So she, for African American studies and th- uh, programs like that, but is she a Jew? Of course, probably. Yeah. I, I don't know for sure, but I'm gonna assume. So why not just fucking lead with that? Yeah. Be like, I'm a Jew. We've gone through our stuff too. Yeah. yeah. Why don't you just like, make a thing and be just like, make yeah. up that like Ross is a tweet. Jewish or a something? Fucking tweet. <laughs> you say like the whole cast is Jews in <laughs> my Ross, mind. Ross is actually a quarter black. And yeah. You know, like, <laughs> yeah. We, we yeah we did a family tree thing of Ross yeah. uh, and it came back. He's a, she he's should lame. be apologizing for how unfunny Friends is. Oh, that horrible. should be the apology to the black community. But also, black people love Friends. I know. I, I, I black don't people get it love Friends. Doesn't like Wale? Didn't he make a whole album yeah. based on Friends? And like, doesn't Kyrie Irving? have a friends tattoo yeah, this isn't great company though my friend jack like loved friends growing up they didn't fucking mind that there wasn't any black people in it yeah, they, they want a taste of the other side too yeah we like Moesha. we like to watch yeah you i know? like yeah. martin i wasn't like yeah. oh there's no fucking hockeys on martin like i <laughs> yeah. didn't care i liked that I, yeah if there was a white guy on martin i'd be like uh get away yeah I'm watching this is my special time yeah you had the black sitcoms you had the white sitcoms right let's know? keep it that way yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of sick low key it's you know it's like when you went into lunch at school you got the black table and everybody else yeah. yes <laughs> of course we had a black table we had a black table we had a black, we, it was the like, whole it was school like, called them yeah. the black table it was like the black table <laughs> yeah it was like the five black kids at our school and people would take lunch. your backpack and then they'd throw it on top of the black table cause like it was known that everyone's like afraid to go confront the <laughs> yeah. black table for yeah. your backpack <laughs> Yeah. So it was like this, like the floor is lava game that people would play at our high school, but like just because they were black. You gotta go to the black table. Yeah. Your backpack's over at 119th and Lennox, the danger zone. In the conversation from a white woman's perspective, I hope Ugh, that you're a Jew. Corky becomes- bitch, shut up. What is these the shots? Leading. What does she like live yeah, at the Boeing? <laughs> She's like, this is me at Raytheon. Has everything it needs financially and can, who's that? Um, I don't know. Continue. Who's yeah, that? Yeah, apparently Brandeis <laughs> University, the uh, Jewish college, and is all. It's, it's only black people. Of, it's a bunch of uh, yeah interracial it took kids. Took me a long time to begin to understand how I. Internalized. Oh, we already watched this. this you are just replayed. Just, just replayed. I was going to share, you know. <sighs> God, I mean, people. it's just these these people deserve everything they get. What are the comments here? Oh, here the comments like I love it. They're like it always struck me as odd, given they were supposed to be in downtown New York. Yeah, there's not many blacks down there, are there? <laughs> unless they're like you know working. Are there that many black people in like Manhattan? Yeah, I, I, every time I went to Manhattan, it'd be like a black dude that like you know was selling a purse. Yeah, on like a sidewalk. Large cities are multicultural. <laughs> like fake purses. Oh, yeah. This is a good... This is, I think it's a black guy. Large cities are multicultural, but it's a myth to think that these different groups interact much. My experience yeah. is that everyone tends to keep to their own. Yeah. Like, what is she supposed to write an episode where the whole cast of Friends is, like, nervous? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're like, on this where episode... Ross is like, I want to say the word. Yeah. <laughs> I want to say it. On this episode of Friends, we're going to a rent party in Harlem. Uh. <laughs> Uh, Langston Hughes will be there. <laughs> they should do this. They should. If you guys seen this video, they should do the cast of Friends shows up to this Denny's like this news yeah. crew. Come on, fucking play. Reddit video is such a hunk of shit. Had a failing health sto- score, but instead of good job, Reddit away, video get violent. <laughs> I've been questioning this is local really hilarious. Managers about critical this news crew just tried to go to a Denny's like a, a somewhere and like. Kolb County. I don't even know where that is. Mm-hmm. And uh, because they had, they like failed their like health test, but they're like still open or something. Yeah. And so the news crew just like walked in and all the employees are like attacking them. <laughs> 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 they're like literally yeah. like hitting them and telling them to leave. <laughs> throwing food at they're them. They're like service industry Viet Cong. <laughs> <laughs> they, like, like, they literally work for Denny's. Like they're at work. That rocks so hard. <laughs> oh, play, go full screen. I can't. I like won't work. Something oh, really? I've never experienced before. Oh, never. A yeah. violent confrontation with employees at a local diner. And it was all caught on a, camera. A local diet. It's a Denny's. It's not, it's not a it's local a mom and pop store. Stored in the cooler for customers. Were you serving expired deli meat, ma'am? Don't touch the camera. Don't put the camera in my face. Hey, we need to ask. You don't need to be in my face. Call, 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 call. Yeah, were you it's serving expired deli meat? To get the meat? cold shoulder when questioning a restaurant about a failing inspection. 
Denny's on Panola Road in Lithonia scored 52 Lithonia. points. Lithonia. Lithonia. Satisfactory. Oh. The health inspector DeKalb busted them for inspired County. deli meat, flying insects, and raw eggs on bacon and cheese. <laughs> but these violations <laughs> pale in comparison to this. How do you even serve somebody a raw egg? Yeah, that's wild. Y'all can get out of here with that. Y'all can go ahead. So we're not going to discuss that. They're not supposed to be in the building. So what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Get your hands off me. Get your hands off me. Hey, hey, hey. 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 It's not the treatment even <laughs> you guys a have no right. would expect from a place that calls itself America's Diner. <laughs> and here's one of their employees. Welcome to America, motherfucker. Right here, if you feel me with that f camera, I'm gonna just throw that stuff. Ah, yeah. Right here, so let's don't do that. Cause I, She's like, this is a bad that example for my right kid. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Is that how you talk? Is that how you talk in front of your son? If only their kitchen was as hot as the employees. <laughs> the cook is flipping. What's your business here? Why do they go so you're hard for this Denny's? I, do, I know that's what's so here? surprising. You're like, why do you guys care about Denny's so much? <laughs> Well, they, I, th I have a feeling they knew this was going to happen. They went down there. Yeah, like, they seem oh. prepared. They're like, this is a black Denny's. Yeah, the it's news crew is also responsible yeah. for this. The news crew is like, you hear about this, Denny's? It's a <laughs> black area. <laughs> <laughs> like, they're going to hate it if we walk in. Right. eggs on bacon. They're like, send the whitest anchor we have. <laughs> Hello, sir. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, what are your rights? You have a failing health inspection. Okay, we you want to talk about the failing, we health, know the inspection? failing health inspection. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah. the camera. It's a charge. You don't care. We're not oh, touching well. you. Moments later, DeKalb County police showed up at Denny's, but not for their Grand Slam breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Officers confirmed we were well within our rights to question the restaurant, and we were not the ones in the wrong. I received a statement from Denny's corporate office regarding the incident. They said, quote, we are disappointed by the inappropriate and unacceptable behavior by employees. DeKalb they County. also said, quote, we have the DeKalb County, to Georgia. Georgia, yeah. Yeah, that's where I, that's where I worked at the dog crematory. Do you ever have that happen? <laughs> nah, dude, but they're, they're fucking, I went to, a, I donated plasma in DeKalb County, Georgia. I was the only white guy in there. Yeah, they put really? in, it they was put, fucking wild. They bro. put it in the pancake batter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it yeah, they like, send dude. all that blood to the Denny's. <laughs> dude, it was crazy, man. It was like the Cab Counties can be pretty cool. Yeah, 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 yeah it was all right, fun. cool. All right, all right. All right. So donate plasma once a week down there. Uh, this video also made me laugh. We have to watch. It's a little old, but with with Roe v. Wade, it's very funny to imagine that it just happened. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, this rocks. This he is a great when video. An unarmed couple saw his gun. They took off out the back door, and he followed. The lady didn't run fast as a man, so I shot her in the back twice. She's dead, and they told her off, but he got away. She says, Don't shoot me. I'm pregnant. I'm with a baby. And I shot her anyway. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> but there's it's more to the story. Like, like they. Uh, the two beat him. They broke in. They uh, beat him. Like uh, broke his collarbone. Tried to yeah. get into his safe, and uh, then he okay. found his shotgun. And then they were running away. And then she like yelled, "I'm pregnant." She wasn't pregnant, but he, sh yeah. he shot and killed her. Damn. You weren't pregnant yeah. when you're breaking his collarbone. Yeah, fucking Gran Torino over there. Right. <laughs> Goddamn right. Goddamn right, Johnny. Yeah. Oh man. Uh, Chelsea Handler has oh, been. Oh God. Uh, what happened to her? Has been hosting Kimmel. Oh. Cool. This week. And uh, I've heard some things about how bad it is. <laughs> yeah. And Where'd she come from? Where'd she come from? She came, she started off just like, she would just like talk about like banging black men. Yeah. And she would just like make fun of her like Mexican like midget friend. Oh, uh, yeah, and right. Just all, all like not, just being like, I'm a drunk whore, mm -hmm. yeah. racist, make yeah. jokes about big black guys, big dicks. And now she's like, you know, the speaker for the Democratic Party. <laughs> and think she's like this, you know, just remember, moral fucking voice for the country. Remember what she said to uh, 50 Cent? Uh, when Hillary was running and he was kind of endorsing Trump and she was like, I had to let him know, 50, you're black. You can't do that. Yeah, yeah, she had to let him know. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 God, you know, God forbid. Yeah. She's pulling pulling black guys over to tell them they're black yeah. Yeah, with a gun. <laughs> I swallowed his cum and I said 50. You can't vote for Donald Trump. She's a fucking idiot. I hate her. She's yeah. always sucked ass. 
So to literally her show, and I was like, I was like, all they do is talk shit about celebrities, and then she has like a guy named Chewy that like look like a Mexican guy that looks like he has some sort of mental damage. Yeah. And like half the reason the show's successful because it's like, look at my Chewy, isn't this? A, it's yeah. like a sideshow. Yeah, like it's a fucking sideshow. And now yeah. you're the voice of fucking. You're Jesus you know Christ. are the moral arbiter of yeah. everything. You fucking moron. You don't you don't know anything. These people. No, none of these people have read. Yeah. Not yeah. that I have, but I don't fucking talk about anything. Right. Really. Not, like. Yeah. You're not going on the like ten minutes. Uh, on uh, national television to spew whatever bullshit I'm not someone I mean, told you to say. Exactly. This is on Kimmel's Twitter, so I'm not 100% sure we could watch. I, if it's on Twitter, I feel like it's okay. The yeah. Elvis video got flagged, though, but we didn't get... From Twitter? Yeah, but it was on mm. Twitter, but I don't yeah, know. I don't let's, know. Just, let's just like maybe listen. A lot of Americans what are wondering what they can it. do to help, and one, one easy way is to consider making a donation to Planned far. Parenthood. But in addition to that, <laughs> I think we should do something even more substantial. Because women are tired of having our bodies legislated by men who've never had a uterus, have never carried a baby full term, mm, and have never off, breastfed queen. even a Cabbage Patch Kid. Sound <laughs> off. So, How's that thought, funny? Never breastfed a Cabbage Patch Kid? <laughs> yeah. Jesus. Right, and, and you've you never can. and you've never built it's a dog. building, or right, and then, and then like picked up sewage, or like been a trash like man. Does that sound good, Guillermo? Bring me my vote. Thank you, Guillermo. Okay. Hey, look! Everywhere okay. she goes, there's a tiny fat Mexican guy that yeah, everyone. Yeah, yeah. Is, there's kind of some subtle racism right, within right, thinking yeah. he's amusing. Even yeah. Jimmy Kimmel's fucking guilty. Of yeah. yeah, I like Guillermo's the funniest part of Kimmel. Yeah, but there's it's always made me uncomfortable. Like like anytime they've always used him as like okay Guillermo like yeah. it's you guys think he's probably like a dumb goofy guy like I yeah. don't know it's just it's weird. There's like that thing where you can't fully say it's racist. Mm -hmm. It's like but you're using him. Yeah, you yeah. are. Yeah, or you're using like the. Uh, no, it's a racist. You're creating a caricature. <laughs> yeah. It's racist. Of, of, of a certain ethnic group. Yeah, yeah. Uh, which is can be very funny, but you're also doing it in the context of uh, like virtue signaling constantly, and you know, uh, going on crocodile tears. And Real weird. quick, look up Chewy. Look up his Wikipedia. So see where he's from. Let's just see where that guy's from. Let's see what kind from, of life he's I, I lived. He's from, oh, Chewy. I don't, yeah. Uh, Guillermo, I think, is from that guy's LA. Real name. I think Guillermo's from LA. All right, look up his Wikipedia. Let's see where he was born. He's like, he doesn't have a Wikipedia. Yeah, he's like, is this not. Are, are, you, are you saying that, yeah. that, that this isn't. He's totally. Uh, you had, yeah, he, he's not you, your wee man. You weren't using him. <laughs> you weren't using him. See where he was born. I don't see what kind of life he's from. <laughs> Chew, Chewy Chelsea Handler. I mean, oh, Chelsea. he died. Oh shit. Oh, oh man, he's dead. Sad. Too much alone. Chel yeah, Chelsea probably killed him in a in a freak yeah. um, uh, cannonball accident. Uh, they, they ate him on Little St. James. <laughs> <laughs> she she was throwing him out of Target, and he broke his neck. Yeah, Chelsea Handler with, sold with him Delford. to Little Saint James. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah she uh, she offered him up to uh, Jordan yeah. Belfort's company. He was born in Michoacan. <laughs> yeah, he's born in fucking Michoacan. the youngest of seven children. Yeah, this guy's lived ten times. Old. This guy's life is probably like a Cormac McCarthy novel. He went to Silmar High School. Yeah. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, and, and you know, probably a cool dude. Probably lived twice the life any of these. Probably fucking, fucking awesome. Lived. Yeah, yeah. I would love to hang out with Chewy. You know, little dude probably used to fucking do a bunch of shit. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck little dude that probably used to do a bunch of shit. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, do a bunch of shit to get where he's at. You know, true. He's a little tiny midget man. It's true. And he's fucking. You know, he's in the fucking yes, trenches. Yes, yeah, he's in the I trenches eating. It. You know. Chicharrones I'm and shit. I'm having Chewy flashbacks right now. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, you're doing wait, a great job. Oh, thank you. Are you? Where, what are you doing? Oh, you want to fuck me? I'm doing oh, great. So now they're great? having oh. him do a gag oh where 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 Guillermo basically molests Chelsea yeah. Handler, a Finger white woman me. on right. stage. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Oh, he's dressing okay. her up like a Supreme music? Court yeah. justice. Uh, okay. What on, a bit. Great. Hold on. Now Chelsea's petting oh, him. It's take a long time. Oh, okay. So this Here, is okay. I can so when precisely I I can we accost shot. women? Yeah. Oh, only when it's a bit on your show? Precisely. I, I, Tell I, me when I can make fun of a fat Mexican <laughs> midget. <laughs> when precisely can I get handsy with is you, Chelsea? Oh, Chelsea. Oh, I guess it's okay if I'm Mexican. <laughs> I love alcohol. Does it oh stop my God. at, you a, at a, said? Yeah, I did. Uh, fuck, I'll what are those wrestlers called the with them? Oh, does it okay. stop at a luchador okay, mask? All right, here. <laughs> does it Take stop at a time. sombrero? Right. When, Chelsea? When? You We've tell me precisely. All week. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, I did have to make tequila here. Oh, thanks, right. what the, I mean, Half the bit is, 
is the guy trying to get the thing on? She's not even making jokes throughout it. This is like, like TV. Oh, okay. This is like fucking an actual late night show. Okay. I want my RBG collar to be exposed. Oh okay. my god. Yeah, she's so not on. responsible for this, you no idiot. More vasectomies. If Partially. you want to stop having children, tie your penis in a knot. She also looks like Skeletor. And if you can't tie your penis in a knot, you're not a real man anyway. If you get a woman pregnant, you have to wear a leech on your scrotum for up to nine months and then breastfeed it. Every time you masturbate, you have to throw a funeral for your Kleenex. These 13 year olds writing these fucking jokes. Every man yeah. must now speak Just to a trained so counselor angry. before you're allowed to grow <sighs> a full patch, also known as a flavor saver. Either way, disgusting. <laughs> Your penis size will now appear on your driver's license. Ha! And you measure it in a freezing room in the back of a DMV. If you are a Texas senator who accidentally likes porn on Twitter, you must undergo a pelvic ultrasound to prove that you did not ejaculate. God, these are so bad. Awful, awful jokes. Anytime Jesus. a man asks a woman to smile, he loses three teeth. You know how many times women have told me to smile at my fucking job? Yeah, I know. Men yeah. now I... have to get bi-monthly butthole waxings just for fun. <laughs> and yeah. lastly, white men don't get to vote for the next 150 years. I'm going to start Why mailing. do white women? I'm going to start mailing yeah. bombs. Why do white women get to vote? Yeah. What you weren't fucking standing there on the porch handing us a mint julep? Yeah, exactly. No, that's <laughs> Give the him another day thing. in the hole. Yeah, that's what Chelsea Handler would have done. She would have oh, stood yeah. right next oh, to Calvin God, Can. Yeah. He'd be like, "Give him another day in the hole." She would put jam all over that fucking boy. <laughs> fucking retards. <laughs> Jesus Christ. God, I hate white women, dude. I, you know what? It's it's <laughs> not. Nah, God, they are a scourge on society, and they are the her. reason everything's awful. Yeah, they are the reason all art sucks. They are the reason everything is annoying. Mm -hmm. White women. Yeah. No, it's like, the, the, you know, they ruin everything. Guys literally had to start fucking each other just to have an activity where they wouldn't show up. I'm, like, convinced that some gay gay guys are just gay because they, like, yeah. are just like, I hate women. Yeah, no, that's probably like they want They, they would have fucked a woman, but right. they're like, I don't know, I'll just fuck a guy's ass. I don't care. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Then we can just, at least, ass, just you know, we can have our own people. bar and we can have our own space. Yeah, you yeah. Know. it's a safe space. Yeah. The eagle. Really? The eagle is a safe space for men. Yeah. Yeah. You know, <laughs> that's what it is. That's what gay bars are. They're safe spaces for dudes. They are. To, to, to share pause dicks. Yeah, stay uh, out. God, isn't that infuriating? Yeah. You know, I. I uh, White men don't get to vote for 150 years. I, what about you? you? Who do you think? Where do you think you were back then? Were you, were you stepping up to the plate? <laughs> oh, yeah. Was no, Harriet she, Tubman a white woman? No, imagine her on the bus with Rosa Parks. Cool. Yeah, she'd be, oh, yeah. yeah, she'd be oh, like, yeah. "You're in my seat." Yeah, she'd be like, "Get to the back of the bus." Yeah. You, mm -hmm. sag you know, it's it's. I'm on the. I'm. I swear to God, man, it is so frustrating. If I if I had like a hundred k, I just I I would j I just want to disappear. I'm so angry with this bullshit. Like, I just want to get like thirty acres in Wyoming for like ten grand and yeah. just give up. That was so nice about being in South Dakota. It was just yeah, just, real America. You don't, you don't hear yeah, any of none of the shit. bullshit. Yeah, I was and at if, an if army. If you do, everyone laughs at it. Yeah, I was a fucking army surplus store in fucking you know Washington. It was just like the best place ever. Everyone there was just so nice to me. Mm -hmm. They sell explosives over the counter. It was the coolest mm -hmm. shit ever. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Now, I, I being a it's part like they of... They had a Nazi flag. It was like... The, yeah, they, had, was a, heaven on they Earth. had a big iron cross. It was amazing. They were it blasting InfoWars. It was yeah. like, just heaven. Oh, yeah. Heaven on Earth. <laughs> it's being a part of the culture war in any way is just so... It, if you think about it too much, you're just like, I just... What's the point? There's no future here. <laughs> this, this girl had a There's bunch no of InfoWars yeah. cards. She kept, like, leaving in places. It was the funniest shit. <laughs> she, like, taped them to sign. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, it's a little cheesy. It's kind of cheesy. No, no. InfoWars rocks, dude. Alex Jones is the shit. It used oh, to. I mean, who's, I mean, you I know, know he's no probably, I at this point, InfoWars is kind of like bros wearing like Epstein didn't kill himself shirts. Yeah, like yeah. it's kind of like, it's like freshman atheist. I, w I want, I want more like, so it's no longer like control the weather, Bill Gates stuff or what? No, I think it's like, it, like I don't know. Well, in, in, it's just becoming kind of like a little too hip well, to like Alex say like, like needs to to AJ, AJ, AJ yeah, of course. Yeah. I love Alex Jones. He let, he let like all these minions in. You know, it just like he still does his show, and to me, he's hilarious. I mean, that's kind of if I watch it when I watch some of it, I watch it to get uh, conspiracy theories. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, 
yeah, he just let in all these like, you know, other people and now they do stuff under the InfoWars name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he, now, he's kind of gone off in the deep end with, you know, after Sandy Hook. And I think he's just been like knocked over the is head Is he afraid of times. like saying what he wants to say? Cause the no, 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 not so. at all. I think he's, he's just, as crazy as ever. But. Yeah, he just might, you know, he, he's not as on point. I'm just maybe. under the impression that like InfoWars so needs though. to exist. Yeah, like, totally, yeah, totally, 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 totally. Alex you, need, Jones is, you need that voice. Yeah, I got, I got no problem with it. Yeah. It'd be sick to go to like, like, so like, 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 uh, you know, vegan restaurants and put like Infowars stickers on the plates and the tables and stuff. Yeah. Now that's like counterculture, and like that's fucking. No, that's I mean we're getting just back at the table. Sick. That's fun. What do you mean Infowars? Putting Infowars stickers in places where it's like people would absolutely yeah. hate it and like be yeah. We went to we went to a twi- the Twilight Town and there's all the fucking like oh. Twilight stuff. Yeah, is really it gorgeous? Cool. The Twilight. Did you guys beautiful. go to the fucking where they film like Stranger Things? No, I I don't know where that was. That filmed. wooded area. But apparently the Native Americans there fucking hate it. Like we were, we were staying at this campsite <clears throat> and the we talked to the fucking this uh, camp park ranger came over mm-hmm. and he was like all oh, the entire night we just kept hearing like. I thought it was an explosive at first, and they were, they were, I saw actually uh, we were driving in one of those helicopters that carries fucking like trees, just like flew over the road with a fucking tree. It was the craziest thing I ever seen in my life. It was fucking Chinook, like a double thing helicopter. Mm-hmm. So I thought that was like maybe some major construction, but it sounded a lot like a high powered rifle to me. And apparently, the Native Americans just own this like beach across from the campsite and just shoot guns into the campsite all night. <laughs> Really? <laughs> yeah, dude. And the park ranger was like, "Yeah, it's really annoying. Like, there's like people here, you know, and they just shoot machine guns." <laughs> <into the fucking laughs> Jesus <campsite>. Christ! <laughs> it was sick, dude. But yeah, they uh, dude, the town's really I, crazy. I got Native Americans. They got a bad attitude sometimes, you know. They do. You're it's always like, hearing Native know. Americans don't like it. I don't like what they do. There's always Keystone. something they they're upset. You know, in about. South Dakota, it was the only yeah. the only homeless people were natives. That's sad. um and like like literally the first day, Joey and I are walking through the small town and like we're getting yelled at by like this like drunk like Native American guy. Yeah. And I'm like, Jesus, like you literally can't get away from it anywhere. I'm like in the <laughs> middle of nowhere and there's a crazy homeless guy. Did you go listen to your coaches? And then I asked everybody and they're like, Oh yeah, they hate white people and all that and mm-hmm. you know, and I'm like, I mean, for over what? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> what do we do? I love the statue of Andrew Jackson. That's wild. They have that there. Every street corner in the main district of Rapid City is a different president, and Andrew Jackson's just there, like with a top hat. I feel like they did <laughs> that. Like he did it do the Trail of Tears. Yeah, I feel like they did that He's just dead. so they could have an Andrew Jackson statue there. Huh? Like I feel like they did that just so they could have one Andrew Jackson statue in the town. Yeah, like, definitely. They'd be like, they were like, okay, we, we want to just do the Andrew Jackson one, but we, we have to do the rest of them. Yeah, because we want to piss off the natives. Was yeah. there any graffiti <laughs> on it or anything? No, no, there wasn't that many. Native American people in the town. Like, I think uh, they, uh, people told me, like, they come in from the reservations. Yeah, there's there's like really nothing, gasoline. there's nothing to get. There's not, like, liquor stores out there or anything, mm. even. So they come in and they're like, they hitchhike or they somehow make their way over to Rapid City and then they just kind of, like, live by the river right there. Yeah. It was like being in, uh, you know, like when in LA, when you're, like, by, like, the LA River and all the homeless tents are there. It's yeah. kind of like that. They, like, stick a knife in the ground and try to, like, listen for where the meth dealers are yeah. at. And shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, honestly, Native Americans they need to they need to get it together. They're always upset. <laughs> they're oh, all, yeah. they're, there's always they're always just I see they're all, it's something every year they're upset about. Yeah, it. they're just always upset. They're always upset about something. Like we get them. What, what? Come on. I mean, what, what? Don't they get like four hundred and thirty bucks a month or something? Come on. I met a Navajo dude. Yeah. Gets three grand a month. You got UBI. They got three grand a month. I met a Navajo kid. I was like, how? He's like eighteen. He had these insane tattoos. I was like, how'd you afford those tattoos? He's like, I get like three grand a month from the tribe. Oh shit! Holy shit! Like, really? Fuck, man. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, what yeah. what do you got to complain about? You get a fucking stimmy every month. Yeah, you were. Uh, I mean, I know there's like you know inherent like I guess there's there's trauma like from cult like cultural trauma or whatever. But like, just sweat ig- it out. Just ignore that feeling. I thought they're and, all about and be happy that like. Be happy all your I people thought. got slaughtered because now you're getting three K a month. <laughs> <Cool. laughs> I know you never met them. Who gives the, a shit? The sacrifice your ancestors made yes, for you. Yes, come on. Yeah. This running coyote wanted you to have three grand a month when he was uh killed by Columbus or whatever. <laughs> I, I don't want to saw. Into I, it. I had a vision. Oh, you have a lot to say about this. All right, right find us on the Patreon, folks. Uh, (laughs) Coming up next. (laughs) I have a lot to say. I had a a vision from my ancestors. That's horrible, but it said, uh, bye, Jack Daniels. (laughs) I was writing the rainbow snake. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, that's fine. What's what's the rainbow snake? I don't know, dude. <laughs> what? I don't know. It sounds like something he'd say. Oh, I don't yeah. know. 
God damn it, Richie. No, they, no, no they sorry. Just, they just so you were around, you saw some crazy Redskins and... Uh, yeah. I'm oh, sorry, I'm from D.C. Yeah. That's how we talk. Wow. <laughs> and, uh, you know, that was a good, you had a good time in South Dakota. That's great. Yeah. I, I would roll the window down and i go like, Woo! What are you so <laughs> pissed off about? <laughs> Uh, anyway, it's all good. <laughs> Are we doing the page? Let's do the page. Let's do Join it. us Let's over. I hate saying the page. I hate saying the page, but it's whatever. The Patreon. Join us at the Patreon. We're going to do another episode. Uh, Patreon.com slash Hate Watch Podcast. Uh, thanks for listening. Thanks Thank for you listening. Guys. Yeah. See ya. Keep, and whatever. Who gives Shut a up. Shit? <laughs>